Patrick was born on November 23rd, 2009 at 325 in the afternoon. Later that night, we were told by the pediatrician that he had characteristics that led them to believe that he might have Down syndrome. Um, the following days, they ran series of tests on him because with Down syndrome, they tend to have other medical diagnoses that go with it. The next day we found out that he had a heart defect, atrial ventricular septal defect, and it would need repair within the next couple months and it would require open heart surgery. On February 5th of 2009 he had his open heart surgery, which lasted for about four and a half to five hours, and he had a successful repair. So we now follow up with the cardiologist. Um, once a year or every year and a half we will and so far everything looks great with that and the more we learn about down syndrome the more that we learn that they're more like than different um, other than the physical traits and being delayed with certain things that he does he's just you know a typical baby he sleeps well during the night and we don't find too many differences right now patrick gets physical therapy occupational therapy and speech therapy each once a week and he's been doing really well with it. They come out to the house, which makes it nice. Patrick surprises us every day with the little achievements that he does. One of the first things that he did that we just get the biggest kick out of it is he can show us how big he is if we ask him. So, Patrick, how big are you? So big. And can you show him your smooth moves? <laughs> um, since speech is delayed too with a lot of kids with Down syndrome, he likes the smooth moves part. Since speech is delayed, we teach him sign language, so he has a few of them. Can you show more? Can you say more? And now if you say, all done. All, right, all done. And now what about, can you wave? Can you say hi? Wave. <laughs> he does a double wave now. Um, Patrick's actually pretty active right now. He loves rolling around on the ground, hitting a ball. He does his little army crawl probably the majority of the day, so he keeps us busy. We're expecting our second baby in September. We're hoping that Patrick is a great big brother, and we hope that baby number two brings us just as much joy as Patrick does.